Hey guys, so today I want to teach you the two easiest guitar chords for beginners. So I'm testing out this new awesome guitar that I got from Photo Savings. It's the Ibanez Art Core Vibranti AS63 in Seafoam Green. It's so beautiful and it's so easy to play, so I thought I'd use it for this demo. All right, let's get started. So we're gonna start with an E minor chord. And the nice thing about this chord is that you only need two fingers to put down. So you're going to put your second finger on the second fret of the A string. So that's here, right here, the fifth string. And then you're going to put your third finger down on the second fret of the D string. So it'll be just right next to it. So it'll be... So that's the E minor chord. Then we're gonna do the A sus chord. So we're going to take these same two fingers, the second finger and the third finger. Well, if you can, I have a crooked finger, so <laughs> it looks weird right now. But I promise you can play guitar even if you have only shaped fingers like me. So now we're going to take the same two fingers, the second finger and the third finger, and we're going to put the second finger on the D string. And then we're going to put the third finger on the G string, so these two. And now you can, you can really plug all of it. But if you want to, you can also try to aim for the A string, so just not this top one, because this is the root note. This bottom one is in the chord too, but if you really want it to sound... So the thing that I love about this chord progression is that because you're using these same two fingers, the second finger and the third finger, and it's on, they're both on the second fret for both chords. So it makes it really easy to switch back and forth. So you're only going from the fifth and the fourth string to the fourth and the third string. So if you're having trouble with it, I would practice just like I'm doing right now. You don't have to make noise but practice looking at where it goes, even before you get your right hand involved. So once you feel comfortable with that, you can pick any strum, you don't even need to strum a pattern, just do down. Once you get comfortable with it and you feel like your left hand's okay, you're shifting, you've got just the downs, then you can go down, up, 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 down, up. You can really use any strumming pattern you want. It's totally up to you. You can use really basic ones. You can use, you know, uh, fancier ones if you want to. So if you want to do the more traditional down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, 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 down, 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 up, down, down, You can pick it too if you want. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to Photo Savings and let me know what you think in the comments below. Bye!